We're hanging over a cliff, side hilling into our secret cabin. Away. Let it pop them, Cody. Three, two, one, go. There you go. So these are some beams to help us straighten up the cabin. What a beautiful day to go back to the mine. We got snowboarding goggles to keep the dust out of our eyes. Ready to go? down the canyon with some boards in the water. Boy, hopefully that doesn't grab those away from you. Well, I can't see him now, but he has a radio, so we should know when he makes it. But there's some happy kids here. Cody thinks he found something. Yeah, but when you go pan it yourself and find it, how cool is that? Right? Okay, bring it here. Let's see. Oh yeah, I see it. Yeah. Yeah, I see it. That's a good yep. size little piece. Yeah. Good job. That's fun. Very cool, Cody. See, I told you that moss would have stuff in it. Giving it a good size. I saw him coming back up here, so I guess he dropped them. Okay, let's see. No. Okay, here we go. Load number two. We made it back from the second load. Now we gotta go up and over. <laughs> Mom's making her way up there. Deep. Head up. Watch out for rocks. I'm gonna follow them up in there. Holy cow, it's picking up. Must be that thunderhead. We're hanging over a cliff, side hilling into our secret cabin. Way in here. Easy to get to on snow machine, hard to get to in the summer. And I should say, only relatively easy to get to on a snow machine. Really? You just came right off. You could have lost her bag in the creek. Well, I guess I'll go down and get it. Keep going. Cabin's down there. Right here. Well, we made it in. We're gonna have to fight the mosquitoes for the cabin. Any mosquitoes are here. So we came upstairs and the flies are everywhere. So bad. I open the window here. We'll let these buggers out, but we found out that the 
stickies were still in it from transport of the windows. There you go. There they Let go. Let out. Free the flies. And get a breeze. Oh, sweet relief. Woohoo! Everybody's a bunch of sleepy heads this morning. That's coming from the guy that saw thoughts cause night long. So sweltering hot in this dumb sleeping bag. And then the mosquitoes and came for you. And if you took the sleeping bag off, the mosquitoes ate you to pieces. Well, they're not here this morning. It's too cold for them. Ah. Pretty sure Luke had a nervous breakdown last night. He did. He's like, there's 10 mosquitoes after me. This is my favorite part. The sun's coming in the window. And you can sit and listen to the creek all night long. I love the sound of the creek coming in the cabin. Well, it was a little cold this morning, so we started a fire. And that way we can heat some water up for doing dishes and maybe even boil some water so we have extra water. But I'm just having a cup of coffee. So if we can ever get anybody moving, we'll go see if we can find some gold, huh? Yeah, we're not really working hard. <laughs> I think we're going to try more to move the dredge because I don't think we're going to get into gold today. There's a lot of overburden down here. we got to head out at like 5. And if the weather kicks, kicks up, which it's forecasted maybe to be thunderstorms again, then um, we might take off earlier. Go ahead and just pull it out over there. Okay, we are in the canyon where we've been dredging. I think the gold's blowing through here and I think it's been dredged before. So we're gonna get this down to the cabin and we're gonna just start running a lot of material and seeing how that goes on the bottom. But if we can get down to bedrock, we could find some serious gold if it hasn't been searched before on bedrock. So, but it could be, Six feet, feet deep, it could be 20 feet deep. We don't know. If it's 20 feet deep, it's gonna be a long time getting there. Okay, Luke, you gonna grab one of those? And I think I'm gonna take the box. Hey, they go up over that hill right there. Here they come. Oh boy, we're making progress. Woohoo! Okay, I'm just taking this down to the creek. Okay! Woohoo! I'm so excited! Yeah, that's awkward. You almost would have been better to have a strap around it and just pull it. This is the hard part right here. You guys, you're fighting against me. Ooh, this is the heavy part. The actual motor engine part. Go down the gut. Woohoo! Go back. That was the worst part though. Yeah. That was the heavy one. So now the last load's easy, right? Yeah. It's just like. We're gonna start dredging this car right here. Okay, so we got the dredge over. And the cabin is just literally right there behind those trees. So it's wonderful because it's really nice and close. keeping our prime on here we've got to get this hole a little bit deeper because we we don't have quite enough water to keep the the suction there so hole's got to go a little deeper
figured it was going to be really close. I'm like, well, when we're out of gas, that's the that's the sign. Are no you, gold there. Are you going to, huh? There's no gold there. Wait, there's gold? Ah, uh, there's a little flake right there. I saw a little flake that, that was in up. So there's a little bit of gold in here, but there ain't much. You should get the other bucket ready. Yeah. Wow, this is some good dirt. Yep, Cody? Oh, oh, there's two more. Yeah, look at that. that Super cool. I gotta take this off. get the dredge secured, get the cabin secured. Then we gotta hike up and over the hill, right? Yeah, no, we gotta, hike we gotta get back to the four wheelers. Then from the four wheelers, we gotta re-strap everything down. But the good news is it's actually clearing up and getting way nicer. Marble flakes. Not much. <laughs> Not even worth weighing. Well, we're heading out. Nice night for heading out. Mosquitoes are still bad. And up we go to Side Hill. It's right there. You can see it right through there. Only 100 yards, 150 yards through there, but you gotta be able to cross that creek to go through there. It's up and over for us. I'm wore out already from a day of dredging and hauling stuff up and down these hills. Ugh. Although this is a lot easier than what I was doing. Four wheelers down there. It's a steep climb though. Well, we didn't find too much gold on this trip, but uh, we got done what we wanted to and that was moving our dredge and hauling some lumber in for the cabin. And a good trip, so. Yeah. Trip. successful trip and if you want to see a video where we did get gold the link will be in the description 